So today I had the opportunity to answer a question from a colleague and I decided that this would be the best way to do it. She had a series of documents contained within a folder and needed to manipulate all of those documents um, to send in a readable format to uh, an individual outside of the school district who did not have uh, Google Docs. And so uh, in this case, the ideal way to do that was going to be to use PDFs. We didn't want to really make those documents easily manipulatable like they would be in Word, for example. So in showing an example, here we're in my drive. We can see I do keep my drive organized in folders. Um, I'm gonna go into my communications folder and in my communications folder, I'm going to click into this state of the schools video folder from last year. We've got a few documents in here. I've got some um, Google Sheets and I've got a bunch of Google Docs and everything is Google formatted. Now let's say uh, I did work on this with a, a video production company from outside our school district. And maybe I wanted to share this all um, with that, uh, the individual I was working with. And I could just share it all at once. I can do all kinds of things to all of these files by checking this checkbox at the top of the column of checkboxes to the left of the title. So we have the titles, the type of document it is, the stars if I want one of these to be starred, and then the checkboxes. And the checkbox allow me to manipulate the document in certain ways to move it, to assign it to a folder, to delete it. Um, without having to actually open the document. So I click on this checkbox at the very top, will highlight all the checkboxes. If I click it again, it will uncheck all of those. Now at this point, I could share all of these documents. So I can click share and I will see my sharing session settings. And I can see that I have access, my colleague teammate Kara has access, and this individual has access um, to them also. Um, I could add someone there. I could move them all to a new folder by clicking this, navigating to that folder, or creating a new folder. I could delete them all. I don't want to do that. I could preview them, which I don't really want to do with all of them. And then very importantly, I've got this more menu. And so I could add a star to all of them. I could move all of them here. I could share them all here. Um, and this is a little frustrating. It would be nice if I could just email them all right here. And I can't, I can only do that if I'm only working with one item in the list rather than more than one item in the list. So if I'm working with multiple items in the list, uh, these two options to email collaborators or emails attachment are grayed out. Um, instead, what I wanna do is I'm gonna download these because the only way I'm gonna be able to email these is in two steps. So I'm gonna click download and now I can download these docs as Word documents, or I can download these docs as PDFs, which is what I'm gonna to choose to do. And same with these, I can choose to download them as Excel files, Open Office. I could not download those. I do wanna download them. Click PDF, or I could have just gone right up here and clicked PDF and it would have changed both for me. And it's going to put them into a single compressed zip file. So I'm not going to see all 10 files. Instead, I'm going to see one zip file, and that will contain all 10 of these files. I'm going to click download. Uh, it's not going to take that long to work. Six seconds left, it says, and it's ready. So I can click OK, and here comes my download. And now at this point, this download is in my local downloads folder right there, and I can email this zip folder as an attachment and be done. So for the question of, well, I need to send all these to someone not in Google Docs format, and I don't really want them to be able to edit it, it's very quick and easy for me to be able to make a PDF and um, go ahead and send those PDFs to someone else, um, uh, for example, outside our school district, because inside our school district, we just want to share those files. Hope that helps. Thanks.